Hey guys, welcome to Overall EDC, and today we got two American Mint Bowie knives. So I picked this up from a pawn shop for 25 bucks a piece. I looked them up, they're brand new, they're like 100. <laughs> so I think I got a pretty good deal. So let's give you guys a quick look at them. There's uh, this one here is Stonewall Jackson and uh, Robert E. Lee. It has certificate of authenticity. This is the 150th commemoration of the Civil War, the, of the American Civil War. They made these, I guess. Uh, so it has a 420 stainless steel blade with a satin finish. Each knife had is etched with the Confederate General's portrait. So on here, you guys can kind of see. And his name and the battles he commanded during the Civil War. The grip, the grip of each knife handle features an etched nameplate with the general signature. So uh, I'll give you more looks at these, but here and there have the signatures. And the pommel is inset with the minted American Civil War medallion. So it says available only from American Mint, and there's only 9,999 complete collections worldwide. To be honest, I'm not for the Confederate side, but I couldn't resist their knives. They're knives, so I can't, I just had to, okay? There are, it looks like some, a couple scratches. So I'd say it's probably worth me 80 or 70 bucks. So it has a satin finish. Let me wipe my fingerprints off. So this one is Stonewall Jackson, it says. So it has that etch in the blade here. Battles he fought, Manassas, Valley Campaign, Sharpsburg, Fredericksburg, Chancellorsville. And on here it says American Mint, it says Stainless Steel 420 PRC. And on the back it says 150th Commemoration of the American Civil War. So it has a clip point blade, a wooden grip here. It has Stonewall Jackson's signature on this little nameplate here. Uh, I guess the Confederate flag on the pommel and the American Mint medallion, I guess. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Uh, Ergo, eh, not too bad. Decently thick blade stock. Has that nice little engraving there with the brass inlay there. Pretty nice. I mean, overall, I mean, it's just like a little Bowie knife. But I still think it's pretty cool. Um, the guard is a little loose, but I don't think it was completely made to be used. It's a collector's knife. Uh, this other one here, Robert E. Lee, it says, and it has some engraved there. Look at that, man. That engraving. Dang. It says Seven Days, Manhasses, Sharpsburg, Fredericksburg, Chancellorsville, and Gettysburg. That's where he fought. Uh, stainless Steel, 420 PRC, and it says same thing on the back there, 150th commemoration. Uh, the edge, I guess, might as well look. I don't know if they really sharpen it or if it was used, but... Um, guys, no way. I didn't actually expect that. Man, dang, that that's pretty good. It's not an uh, actual complete test, but still, it's just something to see if it's decently sharp. Let's try this one here. Come on. That's... That's not bad. Um... Sure, it's not the craziest sharpest, but um, this one here's a lot better. I mean, dang, that's not bad. That's not bad. I didn't expect that. It comes in these like wooden display boxes here. Pretty nice. Uh, this one has this little thing broken off the side, but it's okay. Uh, this one's pretty much fine. Yeah. So I I found these for like twenty five dollars. Yeah, right there at a pawn shop. I think this was a pretty good find, honestly. Um, sure. They're not crazy high, high quality, but they're okay. I mean, these engravings are really nice. Let's get another look at Stonewall Jackson's. Man, that's, that's just crazy. They're pretty much the same thing different handle and handle materials 
This one, it looks like a bone, smooth bone, I guess. It's pretty cool. This one's a uh, brass pommel, a uh, brass guard. This guard's a lot more solid than this one. So I'm guessing this one was used just a little more, maybe. I don't know which one I like the most. Maybe that one, honestly. I don't know. Comment what, which one you like. Not too bad. 25 bucks. Good deal, I think. Okay, guys, I think that's going to be it. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Share this with a friend who would also like this. And go follow me on Instagram at overall underscore EDC. And I hope to see you guys on the next video. So I'll see you guys later.